What's going on, Nature Freaks? What's up, Freaks? Dave and Jeremy back in the studio for another Saturday slap in the face, and today we are fresh off the boat from Singapore. Now, we're gonna be highlighting one of the coolest mammal species we saw in Singapore, the long-tailed macaque monkeys. They were literally in the city, in the forest, everywhere. Even in our bathroom, they make great little loofahs. <laughs> so no more monkeying around, get ready for another Saturday slap in the face. Wait a minute, we got something in there. Did you get it? Got it. Awesome. Nature in your face! With a population of more than 1,500 individuals, the long-tailed macaque is one of the most commonly encountered mammals in Singapore. Like furry little children, they can be seen playing, climbing, swinging through the trees, hanging out in the streets, and using road signs like their personal jungle gym. Look at these adorable macaque monkeys of Singapore. There's three here. There's one, two, three, four, five, and a baby. A baby in his bed. Oh, that was a baby. Oh, these are mommies with babies. He's like attached to them. Look at this adorable baby macaque on a mommy. So cute. Oh, like Sweet little babies. She gone. You could easily spend hours watching their antics and incredible human-like behavior. Although common throughout Southeast Asia, the Singapore macaques are unique in that they are smaller in size, have different facial features, and a larger tail to body ratio. They are a highly intelligent species and have been documented using stone tools to aid in foraging, catching fish with their bare hands, and even using human hair as dental floss. The macaque troops are a close-knit and highly social group of monkeys. They are in constant communication with each other vocally. And can be seen grooming one another when resting and not in the move. The long-tailed macaques are important seed dispersers as they move through the forest consuming different types of fruits and depositing them elsewhere. Their seemingly fun and carefree life is not without risk and danger. From reticulated pythons in the forest to saltwater crocodiles in the mangroves. Even not looking twice before crossing the road. As beneficial and cute as they may be, some residents view the macaques as a nuisance. They will often raid trash cans and enter open vehicles in search of food. There was even an incident in Malaysia where an aggressive macaque entered a home and snatched an infant, resulting in the child's death. Whether you view the macaques as a nuisance or a benefit, the people of Singapore have learned to coexist with these animals to preserve not only the species, but the fragile balance of the ecosystem. <laughs>